In this movie, we'll take a look at adding the Dell 5310N black and white printer to your computer on the Macintosh platform. The first thing that you want to do is make sure that you're connected to the network and using a network cable for wireless or you're connected wirelessly. Um, you can get instructions by going to the following URL www.potsdam.edu patter pj backslash computer backslash computer dash faqs dot html the first thing that you want to do is determine the version of the operating system you have on your computer to do this what we're going to do is go to the apple say about this mac and what we want to do is take a look at the version we have we have 10.6.4 so we're going to go ahead and close that so now we're going to install that driver so for anything that's 10.4 and above we're 10.6 we're going to go ahead and save this driver to our local machine and we're going to go ahead and unzip that and within the folder what you want to install is the first item the Dow underscore laser printer underscore 5310N underscore 10 we're going to go ahead and click that and that's going to place the package on our computer I already have the Dell laser printer installed so I'm not going to do the next step but you want to actually double click on the package to install that on your computer once you have that installed I'm going to cancel it because I already have it installed is you're just going to go want to go through those step-by-step -step process after that's been installed on your computer let's go ahead and select that printer in order to do that we're going to select Apple system preferences we're going to go to print and fax and we're going to select the plus icon because we're going to actually add an item and what we need to do here is along our toolbar is we need to have an icon that's not there you may already have it it's called advanced if not control click once again that's control click customize toolbar and we're going to drag advanced to there and this is only if you do not have it go ahead select done we're going to go to advanced as we wait for this once it's done we'll enter some information for type select windows device another device and for the URL go ahead and leave your SMB colon backslash backslash and what you're going to want to do is type in your username colon password at printing dot potsdam dot edu backslash next CRB STDNT which is the name on the printer on the network the thing to keep in mind is your username will be your username so if your username is Patrick then you type in Patrick or whatever if it's Smith you type in Smith and then your password is whatever password you have um, name I'm gonna change this to make it more meaningful I'm gonna actually put down Dell printer black and white you can put whatever name you want it's gonna be useful to you location I'm gonna put in Chrome library because that's where this printer is located it is in the Chrome library and now I get to select that printer driver that we just installed so go ahead and say select printer software and I'm gonna do a search for Dell because that'll make it a little easier and we're going to install the 5310N printer so go ahead and select OK to that after you've selected it just go ahead and say add you can leave all the defaults as is there should be no reason to make any changes here go ahead and select continue now this will add it to your printer list so now that you've had it added here you can go ahead and print to it so I'm going to go ahead and close that let's say I want to print this document that we have so I'm going to say 
Command P or find the print command. I just edit this printer. So I'm going to say, I'm going to make sure that the Dell printer, black and white, is added. Keep in mind you may have other printers installed, but you want to select the one that you just set. And then you can go ahead and set, select print. I don't want to actually print this page, so I'm not going to print it. But go ahead, you can print that, and you can be all set to go.